If the Indian hockey teams were banking on home support at the Delhi 2010 edition of the Games, their spectators certainly didn't disappoint with their matches drawing sellout crowds. India is a hockey mad nation with a long history of success in the sport. The golden era being from 1928 to 1956 when they won six consecutive Olympic gold medals. Hockey became a Commonwealth sport in 1998. The Indian women's team stepped up to take the gold medal four years later in Manchester. Hockey is India's number one sport going back historically. I think cricket has taken over due to their success in hockey's not so successful time period over the last 10, 12, 15 years. But we've got a country of 1.2 billion and those people love hockey. If we can do well com games and the men can do well com games, I think there'll be a boom for Indian hockey. I love the hockey because it is our national games in India. And India is very good in hockey because Indian team is having very good skills. We have good speed and we need some strength and good tactics. But in skills, we are very good. They have agility that people don't see and they have a set of skills that people don't see every day on the world of hockey. And I think when you get it on TV and you see it, you'll appreciate how good they are. Despite their home advantage, the Delhi games were disappointing for the Indian women's team who finished outside of the medals. That, along with failing to qualify for the London Olympics, has left them with a lowly world ranking of 13th place. Last time we are not good in the Commonwealth Games, so we are coming the fifth. Now we are trying for the Commonwealth Games uh, in the Glasgow, so we are prepared for that. This time we are going in the finals. The problem we have, we haven't played an international game for six months, so it's been a big break and trying to bring them back. So the work that we've done for the last 18 to 22 months is about putting it all in place and making sure they remember everything they need to do. It's like, I suppose, in the NFL where they have a playbook, everyone needs to know exactly what we need to do, and that's the stage we're at right now. We are very happy with our training because we are doing too much work in the last uh, three, four months. And if we win the medal in the Commonwealth Games, we are very happy because uh, last time we didn't any medal in the Commonwealth Games and Asian Games also. So this time we are happy if we get medal. I'm hoping that we get into the top four and then from the top four then anything can happen in a one-off game to get into a final and the chance to have a medal. We've still got a very, very young team. So we're probably three years away from being the best that we can actually be, but getting into the top four here with teams like New Zealand, England and Australia, and we'll be battling with South Africa probably to get into that fall. It'll be a good, good result for us.